Next exciting thing, Suzuki Extreme Four Wheel Drive Cup. So, you up for it, mate? Well and truly, can't wait. Working flat out, day and night to get both trucks ready. Completely new format or here? Yeah, the format, we're going to be running each vehicle one at a time through, so we'll be able to tell who's in the lead, who's winning per hazard. So the peer pressure is going to be magnificent. You've got the top trucks in New Zealand, one after the other, going on a hazard. You're not going to be able to sneak away in the corner of a rally site and do whatever you like. You're going to have your forefront right there and you're going to have your peers watching you what you're going to do. Are you going to like that? Oh, I'm going to love it. So the top class place getters, are they going to be invited? Hopefully the top of the top. With the new format, with the um, your peers right behind you and you're running the competition so your top trucks are, are all together, it might create a new way of scoring so that a, an up-to-date score sheet will happen and you'll get the fluctuating people coming up and down from the bottom of the rung up, up into the top of the rung if they do well. Yeah, well that'll make it more exciting and bring the pressure on both ways. Uh, that I am looking forward to. The other advantage is we'll all be doing the course at about the same time. So the course becomes irrelevant in one aspect as we're all doing it at about the same time. So it hasn't altered too much with 50 trucks in between. So it really brings the pressure on and evens up the competition. From my point of view of, of setting up hazards for a long time now, it'll create a lot more options for us setting up hazards. We'll be able to have nice long hazards. You have probably 10 as I can guess. And start them nice and wide so the more standard trucks can get two thirds of the way through and then really create some action for the end. Yeah, that's the general idea of which way we're going to go. We're going to try and run a lot more gradings per hazard. The other advantage is this time we'll be able to put a dig in there a hazard to alter, to modify it, to make it actually better and not yeah. rely on the natural terrain. So if something's going to improve it, we'll do it to make it more interesting for driving, plus obviously for spectators. I don't know what I'll be doing, maybe pulling on these silly levers or just commentating. See you there.